Welcome back to Max Level Gaming, where we're going to get the skeleton key. Yep. And hopefully finish this game soon, because I think it's breaking Zane and it's just north. It's, it's just north. Oh. I don't know where you go. So I think I've come to the conclusion this this game just isn't made for me. And I love the fact that we started our... Our formula of me making you do a Final Fantasy and me doing a Zelda, kind of because we both grew up with each one. And when my child grew up with Zelda, and you grew up with Final Fantasy. And before then, I've always hated Zelda, and our little run through here has not helped. Not one bit. Not at all. Not even a little. Majora's Mask is like the only one that I moderately enjoyed. enjoyed. And that's actually the one that I despise. You don't need to kill those things. I don't even think you technically need to kill that. Just go around it. That's one you need to kill. Like, once you beat this, it's in the room to your left. Really? Right. There we go. On the right. Just go down the stairs. Do I have to kill everything to go down there? I don't think so. Then maybe. How are you supposed to kill them? I don't know. Unless you have a bomb. No. Oh. Nope. Okay. There it is. Oh, granted, the link to the past hacks we did, I enjoyed a lot. Those were a lot of fun, but it was also running on a really good engine. Yeah. I guess running on the only Zelda game that I ever <laughs> liked. That's it, you can sleep now. That's one way of doing it. Now we can... Go back to the mountain. Go back to game. We don't need to worry about any more keys. I don't even know if this should count as an episode unless I actually kill Ganon before we run out. And if you want to... I don't know where I'm going to get um, I have to figure it out now that we have the arrows. Um, that's true. This place is really confusing. Alright, do you remember how to get back to the arrows? No. Okay. Um, let me try to figure out where you are. There? And no, uh, it's annoying, but it actually helps me. Let me figure out where to go. Okay, go. Go where? Go up. Left. Down that staircase. Okay, I have to find where you are now. Okay. 
Okay, so we're just go right down. Oh, the Zelda won the tutorial video. <laughs> yeah, that's more or less what it's turned into. <laughs> That, just ignore that, then go right. I mean, that would just get you going down to, would just get you the compass. Um. Yeah. Any of these drop bombs? No, I don't think they drop anything, actually. Okay. Because you'd need to go right. I mean, again, those are things that you don't necessarily need, but those would be really good to have. Because, first of all, it's the map, which would make my job easier. And the red ring, which is an upgrade of the blue ring you have. And the blue ring reduces damage. this room, what you're supposed to do is blast your way and walk down that. Okay, so, where are you? You've gone back to the spiral? Okay, um, what you're gonna do is that you're gonna go down the spiral to go back to where you, like, back to the beginning-ish. Go down around that room and go pretty much as far left as you can go. Cause yeah, this dungeon is really, really awful. <laughs> You need to get bombs. How did we get over there before? There's the nearest place for bombs. I don't know. Come on. Here's some bombs. Okay. I might as well go get that stuff now. Yeah, up. Left. Because it looks like to actually get there, you have to go this way anyway. reading this map correctly, which I'm just gonna show you the map. I've already seen it. Oh. I can see your laptop here. True. We don't need the compass, but bomb the bombing, I was gonna say bombing go down that room to grab more bombs. To kill the things. Does the fact that they're phasing hurt me? I don't know. Like that that doesn't make any fucking sense. At least that door's still open. At least. And kill the things so the bomb just drop. 